going on guys? Today is October 28th, 2014 and I am officially two months on testosterone and I'm also sick so that probably <laughs> makes my voice sound way more different than it actually is. Um, I've noticed a few changes since my last video. Um, still very gradual. Um, I just recently moved up from 0.3 to 0.4 as of today, and um, hopefully that I'll kickstart things to, you know, move quicker. <laughs> um, I've gotten a bit hairier. Um, hairs are just getting darker um, on my arms, on my, my stomach, my thighs, my toes hands um, and like I have little blonde hairs here and I'm trying to grow out my little gross mustache you know early you no know, shape November right um, and I have um, surprisingly gained 10 pounds um, in two months which is nuts um, I've been trying to work out like four days a week sort of thing, um, but like I eat way more than I did. My appetite has um, definitely increased, um, which is good. I, I don't mind eating all those things all day. <laughs> um, my voice cracks a little bit um, when I'm like trying to yell out an order, you know, and at my work it's like, Ah, uh, small latte for here. <laughs> it's just really fucking awkward. I try and brush it off, but like you know, they fucking hear it. Um, but other than that, um, I think everything is pretty much the same. Um, emotionally, I'm I'm fairly level and um, the same as I was before. Um, I get random bursts of horniness more, but that's expected. Um, my anger seems to be under control. I get irritated, but I'm never really angry. Um, I can still cry. I didn't think that would happen, but I can still cry. Um, we'll see later on down the road, like a year, see how easy it is to cry, but I think, you know, I'm, I'm a pretty sensitive soul, so I think it'll be the same. Um, but other than that, I think, you know, everything's really straightforward. Nothing too, too unexpected. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm hoping by, you know, the next couple months my voice will drop and, oh man, I'm just so ready for that. I am... <laughs> keep getting misgendered and it's really affecting me. Um, working on customer service every day, it's hard, you know, being a trans person and trying to portray yourself in a way that others don't see you as and yeah. But you know, this is just the beginning and I gotta keep a positive mind and you know, keep my body healthy and just like take this one day at a time you know it's a big it's a big thing and yeah just I, I'm getting really impatient and I wish I wasn't um but I'm sure many 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 other other trans trans people can relate um but it's a beautiful thing I'm, I'm very I'm very blessed to um have the opportunity to get to share this with you and, you know, go through it myself. I am in the process of um, changing my name legally. Um, I have all the papers. I have my, um, my paper to change, my gender marker. I have all those things, but just, like, getting the motivation to do them is a pain in the ass. Um, working full-time and working out and trying to keep the house clean and fuck. How do adults have energy to do all of these things? This is nuts. I can't do it. I can't do it. 
getting like 10 million copies during the day to actually do things. Um, but yeah, I'm in the process of doing that, and um, I'll let you guys know when it's complete. Yeah, so I guess that's it. I do have one friend here. Maybe you should probably meet. This is Alaska. This is our new kitten. She's fucking adorable. She's so small. So little. But anyway. We're just gonna hang out here for a bit. So, um, catch you guys later. See you next month.